In this tutorial, we will learn about indent and tabs. We can use tab key to indent a single line of text. We can also indent multiple lines together by selecting all the lines and then pressing tab key. Like I, if I want a single line tab, then I will press. I'm just I'm pressing tab key from the keyboard. You can see that it's the tab. Okay, and if you want to decrease the indent, then you have to press Shift plus tab. Okay, in the same way. You can uh, indent multiple lines together by selecting all the lines. Like I'm selecting these three lines, okay, and press Tab key or Shift plus Tab. Okay, so this is how we can use the indent and tapes. Another thing is we can use paragraph group, which is uh, comes under home tab. Here you can see that this is increase indent and this is decrease indent, like we click here as you can see that it's just working as tab so we can increase or decrease indents from the paragraph group as well and we can use this these commands multiple time like uh, i want to uh, two tabs and here only one okay and here three times okay so this is the use of indents okay the next thing is we can set a particular value for the indent for doing uh, for doing this you have to go to the page layout tab then the paragraph group as you can see here indent section in the indent section you will see left or right so just uh, click in the paragraph which one you want to Okay, then uh, click up arrow to increase the indent or down arrow to decrease the indent. You can also set a value like I want 6 here and press enter. So you can see that 6 is uh, it's now look like it's looking very bad so we will decrease it uh, in zero okay in the same way if you want to increase or decrease indent from the right side you can do this by using right indent okay you can also decrease it so this is the modifying default indent setting. In the next video we will learn about tabs. Okay, thanks for watching this video.